young child is reading to the child every night and encouraging the child to retell the story. A book I would strongly recommend that you get out of the library is Jim Trelease's Read Aloud Handbook. Trelease tells us that reading to children every night is the most important thing you can do because from birth to age five, what do you have? You have a language explosion. Two-year-old, expressive vocabulary, 50 to 100 words. Three years old, over 1,000. Four years old, 4,000. Five years old, between five and 8,000 words. This language explosion. So we have this uh, important period of time between birth and five, where the, where the mind and the body, the brain, is, is just set for language. It reminds me of Montessori's sensitive periods. This is the time to develop that language. It's like carpe diem. We have to seize this opportunity for these short years and build on the language. And Trelease reminds us the three things that make reading to children so important. Number one, it develops lifelong love of learning. You want your kids to be lifelong readers and love it? Read to them every night and retell the story as you're doing it. Uh, secondly, it builds vocabulary, and vocabulary is a predictor of future reading success. And thirdly, it develops listening skills. And listening skills you can do. So important in determining school success. A child has got to be able to sit, listen to the teacher, carry out those instructions. Take it in the ear, squeeze it out the pencil. And Trelease reminds us a lot of parents, instead of reading to their kids at night, will buy workbooks and have their kids fill out the workbooks. They'll circle the long O and the short E. And Trelease reminds us, children don't have favorite vowels. They have favorite books. And you'll never see a child in bed under a cover with a flashlight and a workbook. And it's always a flashlight and a good book. Uh, so if you take your child to the toy store, you got to take them to the library. You take them to the mall, you got to take them to the library. It's all about books, books, books. Reading them and retelling them. Another good book that's in the library is this book called What Your Preschooler Needs to Know by E.D. Hirsch. And it's got so much good information about reading to children. Like, for example, it's very important to start with fiction, maybe nursery rhymes, maybe finger plays. But also, as you read, point your finger under the word. Encourage your child to look at the word as you read it. 